Hello everybody, Ivan with Vine Skills here. This is a quick video to introduce you to your Lead Docket dashboard. Fully revamped and redesigned to include really great features that are gonna be a game changer. Um, one of them, for example, is a, a page on high value cases. Now we have a page dedicated to checking and tracking your high value cases. You don't wanna you know, lose the sight of those. You can see where they're coming from, uh, where they are right now, who's handling them, how long has it been since they've been called, uh, metrics that are super valuable in there. You can see now also uh, call analysis. You can see how many calls your team are, are, is making per day, per week, per intake specialist. Uh, you can set goals for your intake team and for your marketing team so you know how far off they are from their goal. You actually know better of where you are over time. So that's a really uh, added feature. If you haven't seen our Lead Docker dashboard, um, basically what it does, it allows you to customize the way you see your data and the way you filter your data from your lead docket. Lead docket has great reports and recommend you check it out. But what we did is we took it a step further and allow you to several customizations in your lead docket. So without further ado, let me show you uh, what we did. So here is uh, my overview page, right? Basic overview page that allows you to see at a glimpse your entire business uh, intake and marketing size. I can see how many leads I got, where they are. I can see trends over time, which is something that's really neat. We our dashboard also allows you to set what is a wanted lead, right? In Lead Docket, wanted lead is defined at this point, um, but we can also allow you to select which statuses do you want to be seeing as a wanted lead. Intake performance over time, it's a huge metric uh, as an intake director. That's what I wanna look at, you know, how, what's the performance for my whole team and what's the performance for individuals? What's their ability to, you know, sign those wanted leads? And I can see that over time, which for me is a really key measurement on their trends. I can see how my team is doing up and down trends. Financial analysis is a big one. We gave several um, new features here in the financial analysis. Allows you to see cost per case, cost per um, acquisition over time. So I can see how much it's, is a case co uh, costing my firm every month, right? And I can see progress in there. All these pages here on the left side are brand new. We revamped all of them. The finance page now has our KPIs and goals. So it allows me to look at, for example, here's my case type, uh, what's my average value, how many cases sign sign, and how much is my estimated revenue. This is really, uh, really interesting for some firms that are trying to predict. So you start doing to predictive analytics. Uh, we finally have their marketing ROI, and this is all customizable based on marketing source, So, which is really cool. I can come in here and say, show me my ROI only for my Google ads, right? So. I wanna see Google ads, where is my, you know, Google ads leads uh, ending up and how much I'm signing them. So look at this, I'm filtering it by Google ads and it starts to calculate all of these data points based only on Google ads. I signed 85 cases this year. Okay, this is picking up the entire year for me. And my marketing ROI for Google ads is 34 times. Um, of course, this is dummy data for our, you know, demo here, but you can see how much I spent in Google ads how much uh, I'm, I'm what's my cost per case only for Google ads and all for other other marketing sources as well as for case types so I can actually see only for my MVA for example or I can see MadMal cases uh, all filtered all filterable right so you can really see what's going on overall let me switch to a couple of things um, there's gonna be a bigger video to show you in detail everything about this and we're also gonna make this dashboard, our demo dashboard available for you on the website. So go to our website, findskills.com, search for a lead docket dashboard. You can play with this. You can open up, you can click through it. You can see all the metrics that we have at your own time. There's some really neat stuff. Like we added average minutes to process an opportunity. I wanna make sure that my team is jumping on opportunities. So that's a really key metric in here. You can see call records. And one of my favorite ones is high value cases. I can see how many value, high cases I have, how many are active. And if I scroll down, look here at, this, at the bottom, I can see where they are and when they've been called. This is the last call that happened to this case and this case is in Chase. I wanna make sure that I'm set and you know keeping track of that. Also, we have goals and settings. This is a place for you now to set your own goals and, and your own average case values for your firm. So your dashboard is fully customized for your firm. 
Um, again, check out our website for more. This is actually quite affordable, so don't miss this opportunity. Uh, reach out to us. We're happy to answer any questions as well.